Right guys, how we doing? Back with another video. The 67th best player in the NFL for the year of 2022, Buda Baker. The man who was chased down from behind by, uh, well, call him Godzilla, call him Jaws, the great white shark. I don't know what he was, but he was on a mission and he clawed him down <laughs> right at the last second. All right. We're not talking about DK. He's most probably going to be, hopefully, you know, um, on the list in the top 50. Either way, we've got Buda Baker, number 67. He's a safety for the Cardinals, and he plays like an absolute beast. He reminds me of Tara Matthew. You know, they're pretty much on par as far as size, as far as tenacity, and, uh, you know, all of that and more will be revealed. So let's get into it. Whoops. Buda Baker is a heat-seeking missile. And he's upended by Buda oh, yeah, Baker at the 15. He's a player. He's a bullet, he's a blur out there. He just does everything at 100 miles an hour. If Buda Baker doesn't make that play, Jamar might have still been running. Shoots. <laughs> X questions later. <laughs> Cut down by Buda Baker. I'll tell you what, there's gotta be a point. It doesn't matter how many million dollars per year you, you earn. Or you're about to get paid there's got to be a point where you have to sort of think is it worth it is it worth shooting first and worrying about your health later well he hasn't got to that point yet when he hits i mean he lays into you and i think he walks around at 180 soaking wet but uh he's a hell of a player Am I the only guy that whenever they see Chandler Jones on the screen, the first thing that comes to mind is John Jones? I, I think Buda Baker, man, he's one of the most explosive players in the league. He's smaller, undersized. I, you know, everybody talks to me, oh, I'm smaller, but Buda, you're a little bit smaller than me, man. That's, you know, but how you bring that punch every play. That's the first time we've seen uh, Russell Wilson on screen. Can't say I mind it. I've never seen um, a player play. Well, he got dressed up for the interview. It was such reckless abandon. Oh! He's a force. He comes out of that center of the field and he oh, comes down full horrible. speed. He's trying to take absolute. Him look, this look, look. I'm gonna I'm gonna say this right here, right now. He's certainly got. He, he must have had over a hundred concussions in the league thus far. It's just no one knows about them. Put off. He's trying to he's trying to blow you up. Smart teams know there's only one way to survive Buda Baker. You know, we've got the Buddha rule. Um, How do you survive Buddha Baker? What is the Buddha rule? This should be interesting. Here where, um, you know, you just want you, someone block Buddha. If, wherever he is, someone make sure you go and block Buddha. Well, I was going to say either that or just hurdle the fucker. Because um, he's going to be flying from wherever he is on the field. He's going to be flying. He's going to be around the ball. It's the no hesitation because you'll see him 15 yards deep and then he'll make the tackle at five yards. I like Buda Baker. Just play. Just watch how much ground he covers on this one play and talk us through it. I don't even have to see this play to know how much ground he covers. It's, he's like a missile. Oh, holy shit! Literally, how many? Like, that's a gain of five. The man who actually tackled him was about 20 yards deep. Let's have a look at this. I don't even have to see this play. All right, the line of scrimmage is on, like, what, the 24? Okay. Quarterback it's rolls out, fakes it to the running back. Okay, this someone is okay. So the line of scrimmage, what is that? The twenty, really? And talk us through it. Can't I don't be. even have to see this play. This Can't be. No, it's not. How much ground he covers? This so at this moment, he's on the 15, 20. So there's twenty yards between the quarterback and Buda Baker right now. He's like a. It's a pass into the flat. There's still, you know, uh, uh, look. We'll say what. 18 yards between the receiver and the tackler. Missile. And just like that, in a split second, there's five yards taken off. Buda Baker is coming in hot. I'll say that much. And so to think, to think he stops him at the 21. The 20 yards. They lost yards. They lost yards, and Buda Baker was over 20 yards back in the in the in the backfield. Um, you know, f you know, a couple of seconds earlier. That's that's some real. And then the pop-up game is everything. <laughs> oh fuck! No, I didn't know about that. I didn't know that was coming. The way he comes down and uh, oh shit! 
he's coming and he's oh bro what a play watch this he's there to wipe you out oh. he, he has no fear when he's coming down and he's he's oh like man that play just gets better and you better be ready because if you're not is it's gonna hurt i mean you no, just definitely don't see gonna it coming and he gets so low to the ground he's so aggressive and he just kind of flies through that shin area and there's not really much you can do there just takes you out like knee down and you know, that's the most efficient way to tackle somebody look it might be the most efficient uh but it's certainly not the safest but that's buddha baker for you he attacks everything 100 percent full speed he's just a fantastic tackler uh, i've seen him you know take people down from up top I've seen him take the legs out buddha baker with a great play down oh a honed in reckless he knows how to control it um you know on sundays and you know, this year he's turning that recklessness into picks. The ball is loose, and it's scooped up out of the air by Buda Baker. Just the work that he puts out there, you can see on tape, never takes plays off. Never. He's got a 4-4 40-yard four, dash. I'll give him that much. Or was it 4-4-3? Four, four, or was it 4-5-6? I guess you never really know. A 4-4-5. Four, four, <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I had no idea. 32 and a half inch vertical, 9 foot 7 on the broad jump, 14 on the Wonderlick. It's not the best, it's not the worst, but uh, bench press of 15 reps. He is 5 foot 10. I'm going to call it 5 foot 9. 195 pounds. Went to Washington through college. Got picked up in the 2017 draft, round 2, pick number 36 to the Cardinals. Been there ever since. He's a full time pro bowler in his rookie season. Had a year out, 2019, 2020, and 2021. And the man is just all over the field. In four, sorry, five seasons, he's had 539 combined tackles. Wow. 27 passes deflected, five interceptions, including three last year, which is his career high. Five forced fumbles, five fumble recoveries, and one recovered for a touchdown. Let's have a look at his last deal. I did mention this last year, but we'll go into it again. August 25th, 2020, he signed a four-year, $59 million contract extension with the Cardinals, uh, making him the highest paid safety in the NFL in NFL history at the time. Um, I'm assuming someone has eclipsed that, which is unbelievable in itself. Loves, he's always around the football. He's good with his hands, he's good with his punches. Back to pass, lobs it over the middle in the end zone. Knocked down incomplete by Buda Baker on what looked like a sure touchdown catch. I tell him every time I love playing against him because uh, he makes you bring it over and over again. He's overall a really smart football player. He's always in the right place at the right time. It's awesome. Buda's one of my favorite players in the league. I just feel like the... i got to be honest, man. The more times I see these guys, uh, the more times I think that... Uh, Cooper Cup and George Kittle could be twins. Regardless of that, uh, that probably means nothing to you. Those are just observations I've made through watching 33 of these videos thus far. Or is it 34? Could quite, I think it's 34. Anyways, guys, look, thank you for watching. Um, thank you for riding with me thus far. And uh, in the next one, we're looking at the man with the biggest hands in the entire NFL. Almost 12 inches, would you believe? DeForest Buckner. Cheers guys and I'll see you then. Peace.